On a cloudy November day in 1893, the crowds gathered at Flemington for the running of the Melbourne Cup. As the hooves thundered and the racegoers cheered, on this day of glamour and celebration, the cream of Melbourne society was there to see and be seen. Trackside, there was no evidence of the poverty that beset the poor of Melbourne as the Great Depression of the 1890s hit hard. Fitzroy was a suburb of slums where families lived in wretched poverty with high unemployment, ill health, substandard housing and no social services to fall back on. The day before the cup race, to address this desperate need, the Sisters of Charity opened St Vincent's Hospital on Victoria Parade Fitzroy after five years of community fundraising. With the exhibition buildings just a stone's throw away and demand for hospital beds growing, the nuns soon organised a month-long Easter bazaar to boost their coffers. In today's dollars, they raised an impressive one and a quarter million dollars. St Vincent's has always been the people's hospital and the community has supported the hospital with donations large and small, holding balls, dances and even giving coin donations. This personal support has been complemented by major contributions from philanthropic and corporate organisations. Soon they were building new state-of-the-art boards and training nurses and doctors. Over the decades, the hospital served the community and in turn, the community supported the expansion and growing expertise of St Vincent's Hospital. It has been a true community partnership, delivering mutual benefits in addition to changing lives. St Vincent's has grown from strength to strength, becoming a leading light in medical innovation with an impressive range of medical firsts. Australia's first intensive care unit Australia's first hand transplant, the world first 3D printed titanium heel, and Australia's first biofabrication and robotics facility embedded in a hospital, just to name a few. St Vincent's is now one of Australia's preeminent hospitals, blessed with world renowned clinicians and surgeons, equipped with cutting edge technologies, and staffed by committed, clever, and caring people. During all of these clinical advances, St Vincent's has stayed true to the mission of the Sisters of Charity and their commitment to top quality care, with a special focus on those struggling with homelessness, addiction, unemployment or mental health issues. People who need care but also compassion, understanding and support. St Vincent's began with a vision held by a small group of women and shared by the community they vowed to serve. But it grew with sheer determination, combined with outstanding community support. To maintain its leading edge, to continue to find innovative solutions, to further its world-leading research, St Vincent's needs strong, ongoing community support. With 125 outstanding years behind us, St Vincent's is looking to a future where medical technology and human endeavour combine and the poor and vulnerable are at the forefront of those to benefit. We've been part of Melbourne for 125 years and in all that time we've relied on the steadfast support of the community we serve. St Vincent's needs your support today to achieve the next steps in this remarkable journey.